today yes I've got a really awesome tutorial on to show you guys how to get the awesome speed fighter jet and there's some quite a few ways to do this but I'm going to show you the easiest and possible way you can do it so obviously you could be any player you want to be but I thought it'd be Michael and the one way you can do it you could get yourself your car which I thought I'll just show you my car after because it looks at them look how nice that looks Bitches. Yeah, that is bad, bitches. But look how nice it's such. Have you seen it? Listen to the sound of it. Well, uh, let, let's turn radio off. Well, that is just really nice. So you could either drive the way there if you actually wanted to, but the easiest and possible way is to do this. So you want to, like, basically go to your cell phone. You want to go to your contacts. You want to get the downtown cab. And then while it's dialing that, what you want to do is go to your map. And then this is really important to do it in the right area. If you do it to this side, it will fail. But you want to do it this side and then the cab will take you literally straight there. Which is what you need to happen. Can you get a cab here as soon as possible? Not a problem. A driver's on the way. Thanks. Right, so now you all want to do now is just wait for the cab to come. What badass cars are? Oh, that car was a bit weird then. So yeah, the cab will like beep it on when he's arriving. Michael, stop being a perv. Stop perving on that woman over there. Jedi boy. Right, so I'm guessing this is a cab. So you want to get in the cab. And then you want to choose your destination and then just skip for it. It's an extra cost, but if you've got loads of money, it doesn't really matter. So then it'll take you straight to the airport and then you've got to follow this through. If you don't, then you're going to fail and it can get quite annoying. So, you'll see. You will see. That's the ride, my man. Right, so then what you want to do is you want to basically... Well, you was meant to nick the cab, but that like went a bit tits up. So what I'm going to do is basically run to get a car. That is the one thing that can get really annoying about cabs. As soon as you get out of it, they like just go off straight away. And Michael, damn bitch, you're swinging on your back. You're swinging loads. But the best thing about it is there's only cars all over there anyway. So to be honest, you can either take the cab, which is probably the easiest, but then if you get a fast car, it's really good. Because as soon as you enter the airfield, you do get tanks after you get four stars, which can actually be quite a pain in the ass. So, yeah, that car would have done, but I don't want to get run over. Michael, do not commit suicide. Try and survive. So, yeah, there we are. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There we are. Right, so there we are. No be using your car. Oh. Right, so now really what you want to do is... I hate the rage, I really do. You want to basically drive straight up. I mean, as soon as you get past these barriers, this is when you get all of them after you. So follow my rules to success. Right, so you can see there. There's a tank literally right there. So, yeah. That's a bit weird. I ain't got no... Now I have. Normally, they come straight after, but I've just been like one of the lucky ones to not get them after me straight away. So this is where your jet fighter is. And then you want to get in. They do... The army does give you time to get in, which is awesome enough. And then you just want to get going. And then, luckily, these take off straight away. So, there we are, guys. That is how you do get the Jet Fighter Speed Fighter, which I love to call it. And, yeah, as you can see there, these are really, really fun to drive. But, anyways, guys, that's how you get it. If you've got a hanger, you can literally put it in there and save it. But, if you want to have a little bit of a mission, you can keep doing that, which it is really awesome. I'll get a kill. It does lock on target straight away, which is probably the best thing about it. So you want to do like two watches for an explosion. Oh my god, that was fucking amazing. Look at those people dying. So yeah guys, thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more GTA videos. And the next video I'm going to be uploading on my channel is me having fun in one of these speed fighter jets. Thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you later. On oh, mayday, we're dead.